is the Priyanka. Today we will see the short discussion on recognition of Sanskrit words extracted from palm leaf images. This project is submitted to Dr. M. Rajshagara Babu, School of Computing Science and Engineering from VIT University, Velour. In our project, uh, our, uh, we are do, uh, doing to identifying the Sanskrit words from palm leaf images. Why we go for this concept is, in olden days there is no technology. Uh, nowadays we are using uh, CDs, uh, emails, for storage we are using systems. In olden days there is no facilities. So every people can store their information into palm leaves. So uh, more and more cruci crucial information are stored in palm leaves only. So how we how we identifying the uh, information from palm leaves? That is our ultimate aim. In this project, we are taking palm leaf manuscripts have uh, enormous information. So day to day life, uh, day, day by day, that palm leaves are spoiled, spoiled by peoples. So because of uh, these issues, we will go to identify the all information into that. So we are in this project, we are doing, we are taking Devanagari sa Sanskrit images to identifying the informations. Ancient manuscript record many important knowledges about the world civilization histories. Uh, in the uh, palm leaves, the more and more informations are like more there, like medicines, yoga, uh, stories, human 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 life history, kings history, like more and more crucial informations are there. So, in in this project, we are doing digital, digitization and indexing projects from the palm leaf manuscripts. We are proposing the digitized palm manuscripts. How to digitize? We are uh, taking some algorithms for digitization. These images can be viewed as an storage volume of record. Each large images increase the cost in our existing process in our process there is no more cost less cost only we are taking because of this digitization in by the in this paper primarily deals with binarization of the palm leaf manuscript images using bradley binarization algorithm binarization is not only reduce the size thereby protecting the textual content of the palm leaves it helps to next level character recognition which includes the segmentation. Here we are doing OCR process. OCR is optical character recognition. In our related work, we are taking the adjustments. Adjustments with, to reducing the noisy. Noisy in the same to reduce the unwanted, unwanted images. Whatever we want, we will take that much only. Contract stitching, grayscale images, these are all the parts of our related work. In contrast testing, we are doing the enhancement technique. Improve the contrast of the images. So, while we increasing the contrast of the images, we will identify, we can identify easily the Sanskrit words from the umbrellas. This is by adaptive transfer. Here, uh, in contrast testing, we are taking adaptive transfer function to provide the value of new intensity that we designed by using image basic statistics. Next we go for grayscale images. Here we are doing luminous intensity is between 0 to 55. Create characters and background segmentation. Calculation is done by RGB mode. RGB means red green blue process. Pixel colors. Next histogram equalization. This is also one part of our related work. Here we are doing to contrast the images using histograms. Again we will do the binarization process, skeletonization process for identifying the Sanskrit words from the images, palm leaf images. How will we identify the palm leaf manuscripts? we are using some materials to identify the palm leaves. Materials in the palm leaves. These palm leaves are taken 
here we have we, we can handle the palm is very smoothly because easily broken so based on the we handle the palm leaves to identifying the map images here we are doing storing the digitalized version of palm leaf manuscripts this is doing by kavi hindu monastery usa collaboration with french institute of pondicherry they are taking tiruvanaduri adinam scripts to identifying the ramayan stories image binarization is saying binarization limits are saying we are doing zero one process in basically system can identify binary images only binary images in the sense zero and one values here we are taking some formulas to identifying the binary images binary grayscale images these binary grayscale images are already taken to identifying the sanskrit words in the case of non degraded palm leaf manuscript images we used the simplest and most convenient of global thresholding method with proper threshold selected manually to obtain the initial binarized images here we are doing some process to identifying the sanskrit words these are all sample images here we are doing global thresholding global thresholding is saying we are taking otsu method to maximize the ratio between class variance and total variance and second part we doing local thresholding this is the better thresholding of images to varying the contrast it, it should improve the contrast of the images here we are taking this formula in our proposed work we are taking palm leaf palm leaf manuscript to preparing the set images to eliminate the unwanted features of preserve here our ultimate aim is to preserve the palm uh, leaf from man sanskrit words here binarization in this and we are taking zero one combinations then we are doing some challenges and in palm leaf manuscript contain apicraft due to aging boxing yellowing marks of straining local shading effects with low intensity variations or poor contrast random noise discolor part fading these are all some challenges to identifying the images these are all some sample images to identifying the sanskrit words from the palm leaf manuscripts this image will display the identify identify identification of images first we will take low quality palm leaf manuscript directly we will take grayscale image to convert the direction of operator it will go go to go to the next step to identifying the sanskrit words how we be identify we will take the grayscale images for identifying the words otsu global threshold method to reduce the noise and then to increase the contrast we will take another thresholding method in our proposed work we are taking the architecture this architecture we are taking original palm leaf with color image we are doing broadly algorithm for identifying the images then we will go to grayscale image and then we are using ocr algorithm here optical character recognition algorithm finally we recognize the sanskrit words here we will take unicode text format this is already created by devanagari images devanagari images in the sense this is one type of palm leaf devanagari manuscripts these are all already created next we will go to the our result part in our result we will show some images to identify in the manuscripts in our implementation part we are doing python python coding by using this images to reduce the noise and then to show the grayscale images to calculate the threshold value to identify the 
Sanskrit words. These are this is the sample code. These are all sample images. In our result part, we'll show the cleared out, uh, output of palm leaves with high contrast images. This is sample result. Here we are taking global thresholding compared to other compared to other two parts. Uh, two thresholding Gaussian filtered image compare these three uh, with high contrast global resulting is with a very high contrast these are all two result sample results to identifying this and it was in this image compared to original image and adaptive mean thresholding images global thresholding is high, uh, high contrast image in our in our conclusion part we conclude here compared to other methods will uh, our post work is uh, very important and uh, also low cost these are all differences next we will go to our presentation part again we will see recognition of sanskrit words which are extracted from palm leaf images In our objective part, yeah, these are all the important importance of areas. These are all issues. We'll require more analysis. It's about information scripts need to retrieve the digitality of the images and the processing manuscripts. Most damaged and unrecognized images are there. So how will we identify these images? That is our issue. This is a, a, our problem statement. Ancient manuscripts record many important knowledges about world civilization, injuries, climatic changes, and aging factors. Manuscripts have started degrading. These palm leaves are created long ago, long, long ago, like thousand years back. Our objective is to study waste type of manuscripts and image information, extracting the methods. To study the method for extracting and filtering the image noises to reduce the noises of the images. So then only we get high contrast images. This is our model. Again we will see. In our implementation part, we are using Python code. Like we will go for downloads. In the downloads, I will create one part. Multi code again, we'll type Python code here. Python. Python multi dot by. So this is our result. Compare these four images. Our our global thresholding image is high high contrast. So we'll see the zoom part. Whatever we want, so which part we want, we'll see with high contrast. Wherever we want, we'll do the zoom and then we'll see the original Sanskrit words from the images. So, these are this is our implementation part in our conclusion part. In our conclusion part, in, in our result part, we'll see these are all the images. Some uh, some images to identify the Sanskrit words. In our in, in, here we conclude different ancient languages of manuscript which can be read by few peoples. So 
from the palm trees, we'll get more and more crucial, in, crucial information from the olden days. So we we'll learn lot, lot of, we we'll learn lot from the palm leaves. So these are all some references. Thank you.